Hi, it's Roma, and what I want to talk about now is columns and different ways in which columns can actually fail. So it's really important that we make sure that our columns are strong enough to carry the weight that they need to carry. But there's two different ways in which they can fail. So the first way is something that we tended to see a bit more with ancient structures, so the ones that were made out of brick or made out of stone, because they tended to be quite chunky and large in diameter. So if I take this sheet of paper and just roll it up to create my ancient style of column, I'm just going to take that together. And what we can see here now is that I'm going to push down on it. And it actually takes quite a lot of weight, but if I keep pushing and keep pushing, ultimately it crush. So that crushing is one of the mechanisms by which a column can fail. So the second mode of failure that we see in columns is more commonly a worry for our modern structures, because our modern structures tend to have quite slender columns that are made from steel or made from concrete. So I'm going to demonstrate that using this plastic ruler. So now if I push down on this, what we're going to see is it's bowing. And if I keep pushing and keep pushing, this ruler is going to snap, but I'm not going to do that because I quite like this ruler. But this demonstrates a different way in which columns can fail. So we've got our two failure modes for columns. One was the crushing that we saw in the more ancient types of structures and the bowing, which we tend to see a bit more in the modern ones.